Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Tinker77. So after looking at my item disposal system, a friend of mine said, you should do one that is faster, so it disposes the items quicker. And so I wanted to revisit this, and this is what we are going to do today. So normally if you go into here, and you put your items in, this is the kind of speed it drops at. It's very rhythmic, kind of slow. And what we want to do is we want to actually go faster. So what I've done is I've created another one of the same thing over here and we're going to make some modifications. So as you can see here when we go in and we put our items it's the same speed. It's pretty straightforward. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this so that it can go at a faster rate. So what I did with my change, I took out that and you don't even need these anymore. Um, I put a block here and I'm going to make another row of blocks here. Okay. Now what I've done in my uh, testing was I put a comparator here and a clock. Now this thing's going to go really fast. It's going to blink like crazy. So if I have 32 items in here, put this in subtract mode, you can see how it's blinking really fast. And that should cause the dropper to go fast. So in essence I just took out the circuit and made a different type of clock. So now as you can see, it's going a lot faster. Now, normally this isn't going to work very well if you had like a hopper or a regular uh, hopper feeding into it. So if I did one hopper here, let me do that, and let's grab a chest just so we can throw things together here. So normally if you go into hopper, oops, excuse me, ah, there we go, make weird sounds. Okay, and if we, again, if we had our items, let's say we had some more items in here. It's kind of pulsing. There's like two or three at a time, and then that's it. Let me get those back here and stop it. But what happens if is if you do it a different way, you can actually feed it fast. So if you put a hopper going into the side of the dropper and going up and make this a double chest, now you've got two hoppers coming out of the chest feeding it. And it can keep up. So there you go. So really all I changed was I took out, I left the first comparator here, right in the center, and the repeater there. And I took out the rest of the, of the redstone. And then I have the repeater going into a block which turns the corner into a, another comparator. I turn the subtract mode on. And this here, um, basically in essence makes a very fast clock. And it goes through and feeds into the uh, dropper. Now this may not be the most uh, compact design, but it's just a very simple way of modifying my first uh, item disposal system into a much faster version, If especially if you can feed it with two different hopper chains going into one. So there you have it. So again, this is Tinker77. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please click the like button. If you have any comments on this or any improvements you'd like to suggest, please leave it in the comment section below. If you'd like to be notified of any of my videos being produced, please subscribe and you'll get those notifications. So again, this has been a very quick video from Tinker77. Thanks and have a good one.